and we're back to do a, a My Hero Academia Buck on the Hero chapter 269 of the four of us of the Anime Podcast crew here. So let's get straight to it, guys. You know the drill. Do your thing in the comment section, wherever else. All social media is in the description. But without further ado, let's get to it, guys. Ray, James, what do you guys first think about this chapter? Your thoughts, your impressions about it? Miracle's right. going to be okay. She's going to be all right. <laughs> I think. I hope. Uh, me too, I hope. Even yeah, though like Deborah said, you're good now. Like we talked about in the previous chapter, I think that her hero work at this level is done. Oh, yeah. It's but done. I, mm-hmm. she is, she's going to live. She'll, like, she'll Endeavor live. cauterize the wound. She'll get to the hospital. She'll spend a few months in the hospital. She'll be okay. It's just, all these love for fans of, of Miracle and like her, everybody's love for her and all the fan art is what made her coach she say, you know what? Okay, I'm going to let her live. I think yeah. she liked her too, though. Yeah. <laughs> she, she's, she's a great character. Yeah. yeah. Like, she really is. Yeah, she is. Like, through this whole arc, it, like, she's been the one mostly involved and it shows True. that yeah. she put in the work. She's putting the full she work. Has. Her leg, her quad, her stomach, her, her side, her arm, she lost it on her ears. She's all types of F up. Like, she got beat up. I mean, and they made sure to, like, make make point that even Endeavor noticed that she was doing this by herself. And yeah. for five all these minutes. high end Nomu. Uh, so he was like, yo, like, no, that's no small feat. Like, that what she was able to do. So and uh, you, you have to think about how fast they can regenerate she doesn't so it's like yeah. the fact that she was able to keep that up until backup mm-hmm. came like that's amazing that is amazing and, and, it's, and plus cool. you have to realize that her powers are just a rabbit quirk it's not something like endeavors it's not something like Todoroki, Bako, and this. i mean but that's what we've that's what horikoshi has been trying to hammer in it doesn't matter what type of quirk it is if the person trains and knows how to use it they exactly. can be absolutely one of the best heroes period Exactly. Oh, yeah. She is faster. She is 100% faster. Her legs mm-hmm. are incredibly strong. Mm-hmm. As long as she keeps moving. If she was one on one, even one against two, those no more were done. That she would she would have won. No, she absolutely would have won. If it was one, if it was just two of them, she would have she would have easily won, I think. Yeah. But when it's five, six of them coming left, right, and where she also trying to have a goal. I mean, it was just four, but yeah, you're right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> But then she has a goal of trying to take a shiraki. It's where she has to like, hey, I can't, I can't really focus on anything like this. Because even in page two, we have this creepy ass Nomu coming out with those uh, sharp ass teeth. That design is amazing. That panel with the sharp ass teeth looks amazing. I love how he keeps making the Nomu like more creepier. Her. I love it because like they should be like they're monsters. Like they are yeah. legitimate monsters. And then there's that one panel, um, where it's the Nomu is thinking. And it's, it's, it, you see the Nomu's thoughts. It's like, my body still hasn't come back to life. I can't use my quirks. Mm-hmm. Um, all the strength I was given as a high end, they're oh, shrugging yeah. it off with sheer force like it's nothing. So the Nomu are getting mad that, you know, they're being overwhelmed. Like, I'm like, this is crazy. Like, the Nomu are like, have their own thoughts and emotions. They're coming into yeah. their own characters, which is interesting. So I'm yeah. like, so I have a gonna, quick question for gonna, you guys. I don't think they're going to die here either. How long do you think the doctor has been working on these high-end Nomu? Because Years. the Nomu that we saw that fought All Might in the second season or the first season? First, first season. season. The first, first season. season in the that Nomu is nothing compared to these. Like, oh, no, no, for sure. It's, it's crazy to think like how far these They've Nomu got, have I mean, come. It's, it's also been a long time if you really think about it. It's oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Because like, he did say that he, he didn't pay too much attention to the high-end mo- Nomus. He put more of his attention to the new Nomus to evolve them, to give them more different kind of quirks mm-hmm. and experiment, as well as keeping an eye on Shigaraki so that he can do his experiments onto him, try to do what he can. Like These high-end, like, he had almost up the most confidence that they can handle, a, like, at least I mean, by time for the pro but heroes. At this, least, but. this basically, this chapter tells you that everything they've been doing has been to figure out how to perfect Shigaraki. Yes. Mm-hmm. Everything. Everything they've done with the Nomu, all of it has been to figure out and perfect what Shigaraki is supposed to be. So, if that ain't, if that doesn't, like, scare you, it should. <laughs> it should. Because yeah. that's, uh, like, oh, no. Um, I am, like, well, because the high ends are, like, he keeps, he keeps telling you. He keeps, like, you know, like, the heroes are very strong. They mm-hmm. are, and they can be. Uh, but the villains have been working on something truly terrifying. <laughs> so um, it was so interesting to see Shigaraki just kind of the way he was uh, coming out of the two, because it's like, well, that was uh, that's the before. And then I feel like soon 
we're about to find out uh, what else they have planned. Because, oh, yeah. of, course, when he wakes all, up, of course, All for One has a backup plan. Oh, of course yes. he does. Uh, to make sure that his master plan comes to fruition. Mm-hmm. So I think we're going to get something from All for One for real. Um, so I'm, I, I'm like, I don't know if it'll be the prison break. Because if it's the prison break, holy now that would be insane because all the heroes are in one place <laughs> but then it would be but i personally would find it more interesting that the ultimate puppet master doesn't need even need to do anything and he's still controlling the outside world that, and, me, that's and, that's what, cool. and that's what i'm saying that's what i'm saying like he he what i was telling these guys before you jumped in is that <laughs> he went to prison mm-hmm. he lost to all might of course but he's he's chose to remain mm-hmm. in prison like I, I feel like there's no way that they, if if he wanted to get out, he could have got out a long oh, yeah. time ago. Oh yeah. oh yeah, it's just like yeah, absolutely. All might beat him. You know, he took that L and went to jail because it was like, well, that's gonna embolden, you know, embolden the rest of the villains and Shigaraki to do their own thing. Yeah. And it gives the world a false sense of security. Mm-hmm. Exactly. <laughs> so it's, so, it's so interesting. And so he's it like, does. all right, now it's my turn. I can't let this plan fail. And I'm like, what's he about to do though? What's he got planned? What's the backup? <laughs> but then I recall before this arc started, all might was supposed to go meet Stain as well. So if mm-hmm. All for One gets out and All Might is inside the same prison where Stain is, all these things could come all together into one full circle and it could really be, be an interesting confrontation between all this. Well, Wait, if it, if that, so if that was, so it just in that situation real quick, it's like, well, if that happens, All Might's there, he's talking to Stain. Stain protects All Might. That's yes. just how it works. It like, would. Because even if he retired as a he's, hero. Well, no, he saw, Stain saw him as a true hero. Yeah, yeah the one Stain has was, only recognized two Stain people was, as Stain true heroes. Was, Stain was motivated to do what he did by All Might in his mm-hmm. own weird, twisted way. So, yes, yeah. of yes. course, he would protect All Might. So. <laughs> I, I feel like that's like a whole Batman Arkham Asylum kind of thing where you have Batman being trapped in the jail asylum and he needs to be able to get out or stop whatever plan that's been going on into that prison. But it's... This might be even better to have Stain protecting him because it's the only way it makes sense. Maybe, but well, no, this it would, this it would just be interesting. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah I, because because it's from what we had in a, uh, what Sam brought up. A lot of comics in Batman in the DC has had the villains go to prison for you know to actually lose, but then actually get out of prison and bring more people out of. So something yeah. where all from one could actually do that was just plan all along. Just in case as plan B, like Ray says. So to see, see who was, to see who was there, see what quirks he hadn't had yet, and which ones he mm-hmm. wants to add to his yes, repertoire. Dude. He, he just uh, wanted to uh-huh. he just mm-hmm. wait for the right moment at the mm-hmm. right time. Yeah. And I'm getting the whole Sozin's comet thing and the whole Earth Earth King was Maybe. like, Hey, hmm, I okay, it's time to escape, but I need distraction. Oh wait, an eclipse. This will do. Man. Eight minutes so, of no quirk, no firebending, no nothing. It's like, ah, oh, perfect timing. I'm gonna take back my kingdom or yeah. this entire prison is mine now. Kind of I stuff. wonder if all for one has people in the police system. I because the biggest hospital in Japan yeah. is run by his number two. I think he I think he does. Like I I feel like this is gonna hmm. Ah, like I don't know, man. Good. I like it. I like it a lot. But I want to just so like you know MVP of the chapter, President Mike, straight yes. up. Like you mm-hmm. know, yeah. We, I, I, Mirko, you got my heart. But like for this chapter, MVP. Loud voice. Ooh, that's an amazing move. I'm just and I'm like th- the art for this was beautiful. Like yes. oh, yeah. so much detail. And when he uses that technique, it's like we haven't seen President Mike go out in, in any fight, honestly. So this is the first time we've truly seen him use his quirk, and it is good <laughs> like i was like yo that's exactly it was exactly what i wanted to see out of president mike uh but yeah but like it. you said the art is really good it's in this so chapter good. um page four um this this um art of aizawa looks insane yes, it, is so it good. looks so good it looks so good and he's good. using his quirk against three nomu mm-hmm. like it's yes. it's insane I, he's I so bad for his eyes his i literally said that i can't blink because it's a matter of seconds and life and death. If he mm-hmm. blinks, it's all over. So, like, I just can't imagine, like, you're not blinking. While you're fighting, you have to look left and right, make sure to dodge, make sure to live. It's like, that's... Well, he was like, also waiting for backup as well. Oh, yeah. Yeah, but backup still, had to go through from them and stuff like that oh. to have the numbers game to take him down. Mm-hmm. And then while, like, Aizawa handles the other three Nomus with, like, the other pro heroes, present Mike, um... You see uh, Rock, uh, Shield, and everybody had to go through that last Nomu that Aizawa never got the chance to 
like take down his quirk. Mm-hmm. Oh, and plus we also have a new hero called um, Exodus, the egg gun hero Exodus that Ray hates. He hates him already. I already hate that. I already hate that character. <laughs> <laughs> I Why? Up, I was like, who is this whack ass hero? <laughs> They were like, hey, we need everybody. Hey, he's like, he's doing the best he can, okay? Like, finally, my chance. <laughs> like, finally, my hey, chance. I'm I, have a, shot. Shoot. I have a gun for an eye, so let's I do have this. one eye that's a gun. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Thanks for being here, man. I'm so glad you showed up. Like, we needed everybody. And then he shows up and they're like, he's like, yeah, I'm here, guys. And they're like, ah, oh, yeah, thanks for coming. <laughs> hey, why not? He kind of I mean, reminded me a bit of Deadshot because you know how Deathstroke is a better version. Deadshot is like the weakest. You version. disrespect Deadshot. Deadshot's like a, lot, a lot cooler. <laughs> you you so much cooler. No, no, so I'm just cooler. saying. I'm just saying. Like, kind of. This guy like is just here at the right moment at the right time. It's I, true. I, I would say he's like more of Booster <laughs> Gold in they, a way. They were don't disrespect Booster Gold. Like, <laughs> Booster Gold, Gold man. I mean, no. Come, it's like they're like, hey, who else? Who who doesn't? Who isn't like actively helping right now? Oh, Gun Eye's not doing anything. Get in there and help President Mike, please. Go through. <laughs> well, speaking about um, good reaction and everything, we have uh, the doctor again with good reaction in page eight and also in page 10. His face expression is like, my creation now. I mean, he's, he, like he said, Art he style. spent his life like his, perfecting his this dream. for this dude. Like this is this is his dream as well. And yeah. so that's why he's been like so and, distraught that they're like there, like ruining everything. And he hates the whole half-baked, like, creation of this. And but I then, also think that he's sad that he's letting down off of one. Like, I feel like they were, like, actually, like, kind of, like, weirdly friends, um, which is interesting to me. Uh, so I'm like, hmm, I don't know what that is. I don't think – is it fear that he's motivated by or is he just sad that him and his friends dream, or I guess the person who he worships is the lord of evil – um, I think the doctor sees All for One as a friend for sure. That's what I yeah. don't think yeah. All for One sees him as a friend. I don't well, he know. He sees Shig- like he, you know he cares about something, which is Shigaraki, so it's possible. Yes. I feel like it's yeah, a, because he I, sees he always saw him as the ultimate weapon. He saw Shigaraki as his trump card. He saw he, the destruction because he chose him. I, he yeah, because he could Shigaraki. mold him. He could <laughs> literally mold him from when he was a kid to what he is now. Mm-hmm. That's all he saw. To me, anyway. I don't know. I feel like we're gonna learn more about that. I really do. I feel like there's gonna be there's some there's got to be an emotional connection that would make all for one do this. I mean, yeah, he's cause he's a mastermind, but there's got to be an emotion that elicited in him to put this much effort into it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah we'll see. And plus, like, and right, plus, right, right, oh, sorry, go ahead. No, no, no. Go ahead, no, 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 fine. Go ahead. No, go ahead. <laughs> plus I uh, totally agree with what Ray said is that the Lord of evil's dream will die. He called him the Lord of evil, Like he knows that he's the master. Is that the he's first the time that we've devil. heard him be referred to like that? Yes, yes, the yes that's why I is. find that ridiculous. Are you trying to tell me there's a god of evil or a king of evil? Or some like, like some guess, <laughs> Duke of evil. So, so, so from what I see, then it's like so the all, all for one is the Lord of evil. So I'm guessing the one for is the god of heaven for it to be like that type of symbolic for what it was or from what it seems. Well, yeah, you I know mean, what I mean? You they're they're yin and yang. Yeah, exactly. They're the yeah. ultimate evil and the ultimate good. They mm-hmm. both stem from each other. So mm-hmm. it's like mm-hmm. it's the it's perfect symmetry. I right, man, we go. Time skip soon. Come on, Horikoshi. Like for real. <laughs> you really want that, don't you? you really I do, because there's so there's so soon. much there's so much that has to happen that I feel like he could explain really well after a time skip. I think like something something big is have to, something really big has to happen, and then we get the time skip. After this like, arc, you, you want to like cut off like arc. the ending of this where you don't even know the ending, you don't know the prediction, and the time skip happens, and then I, I would like to say we see a conclusion one way or another. Mm-hmm. Um, and then there's the time skip because that would be like the these, ultimate. Team. I don't know, but we still have to see the kids. But like, there's so much development that has to happen to these students for them to get anywhere close to what's about to come out of this. True. Yeah, because for yeah. them, this is this technically this 269 chapters technically is still the first freshman year of high school for mm-hmm. them. So mm-hmm. that's him saying that they're having a tough year for the first year. Oh, they've had a terrible, terrible year, year actually. <laughs> <laughs> they've had a terrible year. Uh, but I don't know. I'm just excited to see what happens next. Like. Her coach has been like delicately like plotting us along, and it's like, all right, now it's time. <laughs> so I'm, I still think 270 is about to be it. Like 270 is going to, that was going to hit different, I think. I still think so. You've been yes, saying that I for agree. weeks, so mm-hmm. I do see that happening. I do. But I, do I don't know that. in which direction, though. Me either. I don't know. Either. Do we jump back to Tokoyami and Hawks? I think, do I we think jump we, to I Deku think, and Bakugo? Yeah, so, like, we still James, I, we still James I really do think yet. that they, um, 
they jump from here because this is this is kind of like a, a a soft ending for this. This is the resolution to this one here. So I oh, think yeah, we do jump yeah, somewhere yeah. else. So it's like which one do we go to? Is is what I want to know. Like, like I mean, which one? At the moment, right now, it's the peak climb. When was the like last time we else. saw Deku? How many chapters ago was that? Yeah, two, we, we keep saying that. <laughs> we keep saying that. Two fifty like at minimum two or three, I think. It's it was we no, haven't seen Deku in no. like I felt like Ten. almost. I think two. I'm gonna find out. I right feel now. like it's been almost fifteen chapters since we saw Deku. About there. No, like, I don't think so. I think so. Yeah, has it really been that long? Yeah, it's yeah, been a yeah, long yeah. time a long since we time. saw Deku. Well, I've been binging, so to me, it's all like running true, together. True, honestly. true. But <laughs> we okay. haven't we haven't seen Deku in a hot minute, so um. I don't know, man. It's like, oh, do we finally go back to Deku? Is the next like, is the next cover our boy Deku? I mean, that would make sense. <laughs> I'm, I'm afraid, like our old theory and past, like our, our prediction that something's gonna happen to present Mike, like something that like he might die or something bad's gonna happen to him. Because right now he's in Possibly. the front line. Mm-hmm. He, he, he's. I mean, there were actually a lot of people there with him. If you look at the panel, yeah, like the the hero that checked on Shigaragi. Oh, he's not breathing. So it's X Gun. So expendable immediately. <laughs> uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, so that's what X is for. I'm telling you, I think I think he's there because he's expendable. He could die immediately. It's crazy to believe that this this whole hospital thing started at 260. The last time we saw our Deku in them was 261 and 259. Oh my god! Yeah, yeah, so like that's 10, crazy. Oh, no, it's been a while. Chapters. I was just looking for it. Yeah, it's been a while. So yeah, so, that's crazy. We know that. Shigaraki... Can we talk about that second to last panel real quick? Okay, yeah. Where yeah. everyone's holding that one no move and one no just blowing his head off I, like i love that that's gonna look that's so, so good sick. animated right? animated that's gonna be insane i can't wait oh man and with, this is, whole this whole thing animated is going to be but literally it's, nuts. Okay. it's literally rock lock the dragon girl endeavor literally everyone going and then down that, on the, yeah, that one like five heroes i know for that <laughs> one no one <laughs> And I still don't think she done to be completely like I'm like oh definitely not Endeavor's knocking her face off but like I don't know man she gonna do something crazy with last ditch effort they have these uh, hyper regenerations we don't know what's their full entire limit like is it gonna be like cell where they just need that one like cell like if you miss one cell you don't completely destroy it. yeah and I true. think yeah because that, that first, that first, that first no move that Endeavor fought yeah like he it, had to destroy the head completely mm-hmm. but I feel like the they 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 took that data. And they were like, well, we can't put the core in the head anymore. Right, right. No. So, no, no, no. and that's all they yeah, know. That's why I'm thinking this maybe, no not done. Maybe it's like in Boruto, to they could switch the core in different parts of the body while they fight. Yeah, they did that in One Punch Man, too. Yeah. I, like, I just feel like they learned, they, and they sent those high ends out specifically to learn this. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. So, they, I'm pretty sure they learned from that data. Um, so, I don't think that this is them killing that no move. Um, and they got the best data ever because one high end fought the number one hero. One hero. <laughs> and that's and that's why that one screamed. It was like, hey, you're number one. I know you are. And yeah. I want you to like, yeah, he's like, I want to fight you essentially. <laughs> so I was like, oh my God. Yeah, make me feel more amazing. So, Imagine okay. just quick just quick there to pop in my head. Imagine the doctor, even though he knows he may die, imagine if he put his consciousness inside some type of inside in some a type normal. of supercomputer. I'm hoping that he already mutated himself and his last ditch effort is Mm -hmm. to turn into some different type of Nomu. That's what I'm hoping. Because if he he just dies or gets arrested, that'll be boring to me. Yeah, Because we know that he has a quirk. I kind of would be okay with him getting arrested because he can give us a lot more backstory than we, like, that would be the way for them to get the backstory uh, is from the doctor himself. Uh, I feel like that would would propel the story. I would appreciate that. Yeah. Yeah. Um, Because there's still so much that we don't know. So much. Yeah, like, I I want chance. him to be free and continue his work. I would love that, but I would also be like, be like, hey, spill it. Like, how long have you been working for Offer One? Who the fuck is Offer One? Like, yeah. tell us. So, like, we want to know. Um, yeah. Like, we get that information from him would be really nice. <laughs> and Sam, I would say like maybe Sugar Rocky. Like, I don't want you to spill any answers or spill any questions and stuff. Like, you're already dead weight to me. It's already. Like you failed to give me into full perfect condition. This is half baked condition. I don't think that Shigaraki would blame him for this because it's not his fault. It's yeah. not. I, I mean, like he, you know, he can't do nothing about it. But he mm-hmm. can't leak out any information or story to the heroes. Any. I mean, you could say that about any other people yeah. that we've been working with. We have a whole group of people at that mansion willing to snitch. I'm sure. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Who knows? So Maybe cool. they're like, well, there seem more like religious cult where they would never spill anything. I don't kind know of about all that. I don't know about all that. But I would like to the see the right how amount of the... pressure. Yeah. <laughs> That's and all like the, I just, just see... the right amount of money. 
there's so much happening. There's so much he has to wrap up, and I want to know how long it's going to take for him to wrap it all up. Because uh, yeah. he's got so many different like scenarios and plot strings just out there right now. I'm like, all right, Horror Coach, how are you going to bring them back together? Question. Last thing to ask. Do, do you guys think the line the doctor said, I've only been living for the boy's sake for Shigaraki. Do you think the boy's sake is awful one? No, I or, think he's talking about Shigaraki. Shigaraki. Okay. Shigaraki. Yeah. 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 Because that's interesting that he's only been living like for Shigaraki's um sake. Yeah, she continues well. continue saying that. Like I've been living for the boy's sake for Shigaraki. Like literally just just kind but of it's, but it's but it's and then he goes, but it's over now, it's all over. Yeah, because yeah. I mean he dedicated his life to all for one and all yeah. for one chose Shigaraki as his successor. Mm -hmm. So of course he would put everything he has into what all for one wants. But like it's not like Shigaraki's dead. He's just he just stopped his heart with whatever. The I don't water, know. This is I feel like this is one of those things where it's like yeah, you know, like Shigaraki. <laughs> I think he's just gonna wake up on his own. To be completely honest. Oh yeah, it's, it's yeah. just like Ray has been saying. The heroes has been winning, winning, oh, winning. Those heroes right have had nothing but W's. Nothing yeah, yeah, but right W's. Right now, that's they're how stories go, go, man. We're, we're waiting right for that roller coaster keep winning forever. Mm -hmm. Right now, they're about to get their full stop. And then go down here. And it's, and it's like, you know, I, gonna I, don't, wake up. I don't want the heroes to lose because, you know, they're heroes. But yeah. it's like, they, like, that's what makes the story interesting. Like, mm -hmm. Yeah, for sure. Oh, oh, they're, they're, I think they're going to lose this battle for sure. Oh, yeah. And yeah. then they'll win the war eventually. Oh, but yeah, this exactly. battle mm -hmm. will be lost as soon as Shigaraki I mean, wakes they're gonna, up. They're going to lose one, like, they're going to lose the most important battle. Like, you know, yes. they've, they've won a lot of the small skirmishes, but, like, they're going to lose the most important battle. But um, then right now, like, which, is this the, like, last final like ultimate battle like is this the peak or is there another chapter where there's gonna be another peak i think there's no, another, so we there's haven't thing. hit the peak yet yeah, yeah we're, so we're chapters away from the so peak. it's technically still climbing up there's still gonna get at least maybe one more w into this chapter in this arc and now because so. there's there's more teams in the uh -huh. liberation yeah, exactly front. we have to yeah, see yeah, yeah, yeah. the perspective from all of those other teams because there's four total teams mm -hmm. yeah so we need to see the perspective from those. We still need to yeah. get back to Hawks, see what's going on with him. Uh -huh. And Tokayami, I, I think he's going to get some new ability to save Hawks. Like, mm -hmm. there's so much to do, man, before we get to the pinnacle the, of what's I mean, going and on I'm, right now. I'm talking just the climax of, like, this arc. <laughs> you know, yeah, we, haven't, yeah. we haven't even got to the climax of this arc, this arc. you know? Yeah. So it's like, uh, okay, um, I'm but waiting to see it. But with that, guys, do you have any more thoughts about the chapter? What do you guys think? Like, any last thoughts, any last fragments of what speculation? Because in two weeks, we come back for this again. Yeah, I mean, like I said, and like, like I put out a tweet, I'm like, this chapter answers a lot of questions and then just puts out even more questions for what's coming on, what's going to happen later on. So we'll see what happens. I just have questions. My hero is in its best form. It has been in a while right now. Uh, I think the story is so good. All the characters are on, like everything is Horikoshi is following. He's firing on all cylinders, you know, to use that, you know, try to <laughs> thing. It's, yeah. it's, it's working. He's doing really good work right now. So like, all right, keep going. <laughs> Sam, I'm here for it. Um, yeah, for sure. I'm okay that uh, Show and Jump wants to do this bi-weekly at the moment, especially when what's going on in the world. Yeah, of course. Come on, James. Think of the people's health. I know. People's I know. health. Okay. <laughs> but yeah, um, I've, for sure, it's hard to wait, but in situations, yeah, we can hold on a little bit and good. hopefully yep. it goes back into a weekly, better scheduled uh, series. And that's really good that it's all been digital where you can just scan the artwork and the of work course. into the publishers so they don't have to be person to person or mail the mm -hmm. stuff and all that other thing. Yeah. So I'm really glad that My Hero is still continuing, even though it's in two weeks. Still it's something. something. You'll Same survive. Today. Yes, yes. that's other stuff to read. Not just read One Piece. You have 900 chapters to get into, so don't worry. You have time to read. I'm so. reading so much shit right now. So. I'm so glad that you're on the other side of the screen, not in the same room, because, like, God, I just... So I just read One Piece, because we have one of the best captains, one of the best characters, not like Gone. Other than that, guys, thank you guys for watching and enjoying this review of My Academia. Like, comment, subscribe. Join the anime league. Everything you got to do, guys. Tell you next time. Peace. Thank you.